when I was in JC, my JC history tutor, she used to come into class with lots of maps and paraphernalia and she would tell us stories of the past and I got interested in that. And I felt that I could probably do the same with my own set of students. Teaching is my first job. At the end of my third year in service, I became a subject head for history. It was challenging. The students initially felt that it was boring and how much more is there to learn about Singapore. So into the few months of teaching, I decided to approach the content differently. So I got them to inquire instead of just narrating the content in the textbook. I worked with my team of teachers to think of ways in which we can engage our students to become more active citizens. We felt that it starts with knowing your immediate neighbourhood well. Their task was then to conduct oral interviews, speak to pioneer residents, it could be their own grandparents. We put these stories together and we developed a website. Subsequently, the website content was turned into exhibits in collaboration with National Heritage Board. I truly believe in lifelong learning, which is why I pursued my Masters through the PDCM scheme, which is the part-time scheme. And I did that on the curriculum and teaching because I wanted to see how I can use different pedagogical approaches to help my students better engage in historical understanding. I could see that the way I approach the subject helped them connect with the subject better and got them excited. I teach my students, you will always be able to practice creative, critical thinking if you're a historian. It teaches you to reason, teaches you to question. You are able to make sense of the way the world moves. In teaching history, I've become more conscious of the value of the subject. I'm now a strong advocate of the subject. I think the motivation really comes in the spark that I see in the child's eye when the moment they feel that I understand this and you help me understand this. So you feel that you have a purpose and you are here for a reason and I find meaning in my job.